Today, I'm going to be showing you how to download and install the SimCity Loans 2.0 mod for your Sims 4 game. The first step is we're going to go to this website right here. I'm going to go ahead and leave it in the first link in the description. Once we get to this website, we're going to go ahead and scroll all the way down until you see attachments. You're going to go ahead and click the SimCity Loans zip file right here to download it. You may not get this pop-up right here, but it's just asking to save it to your downloads. Go ahead and press save. And then we're going to go ahead to our recently downloads right here we're gonna click it and drag and drop it onto our desktop or then we're gonna go ahead and open up our file explorer we're gonna click documents we're gonna click electronic arts then we're gonna click the sims 4 and if you do not have a mods folder you can go ahead and right click anywhere here click new click folder and label it mods then once we have a mods folder we're gonna go ahead and open it up and we're gonna right click anywhere here click new click folder and then we're going to create a folder for our mod called sim city loans we created a folder for our mod if there's any updates that come out we would be able to find our mod easily so we could update it so we're going to go ahead and open up our folder now we're going to extract our zip file if you have windows 11 you could just go ahead and right click and extract all but if you do not i'm going to go ahead and leave a zip file extractor extension in the description so we're going to go ahead and right click our zip file press extract all click browse then we're going to click documents we're going to click electronic arts we're going to click the sims 4 then we're going to click mods and then we're going to go to our mods folder that we created for our mod we're going to go ahead and open it up and press select folder and press extract once you see it extracted two files right here, we're going to go ahead and delete our zip file. We're going to press delete and we can go ahead and close this and test it out in our game. As you see, when we load up our game, we get this mods pop up right here. And as you see underneath custom content, we have our SimCity loans mod right here. And underneath script mods, we have our SimCity loan right here as well. Once you see that we have it underneath custom content and script mods, we could go ahead and press the check mark. If for whatever reason you did not get that mods pop up, we're going to go ahead and press these three dots right here we're gonna go to game options we're gonna go to other and make sure you have enabled custom content and mods and script mods allow check mark you're gonna press apply changes and you're gonna press the x then you're gonna press exit game and then you're gonna go ahead and relaunch your game once you get the mods pop up we're gonna go ahead and test it out in our game to test this mod out you do need a computer and then once you have a computer we're going to click on it then you're going to go to more choices and then you're going to go to sin city loan and then as you could see we have an option to apply for a thousand ten thousand a hundred thousand twenty five thousand and so on and so forth the max that you could apply for is five hundred thousand simoleons now we're going to go ahead and apply for a loan let's apply for the smallest loan first for a thousand simoleons and then you have the option of the payments that you can make you could do 12 payments 24 payments or 36 payments these payments are taken once a week. So let's do 12 payments. You can see our sim is going on to log in for the payment. She's applying for her loan. And then as you can see, we get this notification right here that our loan was approved and you have to repay this loan before you take out another loan. And then if you go to your inventory right here, we have our loan packet. And if we click it, we could full repay the loan or we could start making our payments. And when your debt is paid, it says congratulations you have paid off your loan to the SimCity Bank and now you could destroy your packet. So now we're going to try applying for the major loan, which is the 500,000. We're going to go ahead and press apply for 500,000 and let's do it for 36 payments since it's a large loan. And then as you see, we were approved for that loan. This is our SimCity loan packet. We open it up. We could pay it in full we then, or we could make a payment of $14,583 a week. Okay, and as you see, we get this pop up right here saying that we have a loan payment due and that we have to click on our loan packet to make our payment. And we have 24 hours. If not, we get a late fee. If we did not make our payment on time, we get this notification right here that says loan payment overdue. And it says that she didn't get to her loan payment on time and she needs to make her payment soon to avoid stress and to avoid additional late fees. If this video has helped you out, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and I'll see you guys next time.